Have gun will travel the timeless Western classic step back in time to the rugged and lawless Wild West with the iconic television series Have Gun will travel, which first aired in 1957 and quickly became a beloved staple of American television. This Western classic captivated audiences with its compelling storytelling, unforgettable characters, and a thrilling blend of adventure, drama, and moral dilemmas. The show follows the enigmatic and sophisticated gunfighter Paladin, portrayed brilliantly by Richard Boone. Paladin is a man of intellect and principles, a skilled gunslinger, and an expert in problem solving. He traverses the untamed landscapes, offering his services to those in need and always seeking to bring justice and uphold a code of honor in a world where law and order are often scarce. One of the reasons for the show's enduring popularity is undoubtedly the mesmerizing performance of Richard Boone. His portrayal of Paladin was a perfect balance of tough exterior and underlying vulnerability, making the character a multi-dimensional and relatable figure for viewers of all ages. Boone's acting prowess was further complemented by the show's impeccable writing which delved into complex moral themes, ethical choices, and the human condition. Adding to the allure of Have Gun, Will Travel was the presence of other talented actors and actresses who contributed to its success. Notable guest stars made appearances, including the likes of Charles Bronson, Lee Van Cleef, and Jack Lord, among others. These gifted performers brought their own charisma and flair to the series, enhancing the depth and variety of each episode. As the show aired during a time when television was just beginning to establish itself as a dominant form of entertainment, Have Gun, Will Travel captured the hearts of millions of viewers with its captivating storytelling and engrossing characters. It struck a chord with the audience, offering a unique blend of action, philosophy, and human drama that left a lasting impression. If you were one of the viewers fortunate enough to experience the excitement, and charm of Have Gun, Will Travel. Do you have any fond memories or favorite episodes that still resonate with you today? Perhaps Paladin's words of wisdom or his unwavering commitment to justice left an indelible mark on your own beliefs and values. Whether you're a longtime fan or a newcomer curious to explore the golden age of television, Have Gun, Will Travel remains a timeless gem, capturing the essence of the Wild West and the human spirit. So, saddle up and embark on an unforgettable journey through the dusty trails of the past, as you join Paladin on his quest to bring justice to those in need. In the golden era of television emerged a captivating series that transcended time and space. Have Gun, Will Travel, a remarkable show in 1957, left an indelible mark on American TV. Unlike others, it took a unique path, defying conventions. The enigmatic paladin, brilliantly portrayed by Richard Boone, was not just a gunslinger, but a man of intellect and principle, navigating morality's complexities. The show's allure lay in its blend of Western action, intricate storytelling, and moral dilemmas. Paladin's compassion and wit often surpassed bullets in resolving conflicts. The radio adaptation, led by John Daner, added a new layer to the character, solidifying its legacy worldwide. Even after its conclusion, Paladin's legend and iconic calling card resonated through pop culture, inspiring adaptations across literature, films, and TV. Have Gun, Will Travel's impact was unparalleled, leaving a permanent niche in the hearts of Western enthusiasts. As new generations discover its magic, the legacy lives on, a testament to its creator's brilliance, the character's spirit, and the fans' unwavering devotion. Step back in time to the golden era of late 1950s TV, where the beloved series Have Gun, Will Travel offered captivating narratives and thrilling adventures. This iconic show's 225 episodes exuded Old West mystique and were graced by the visionary writer Gene Roddenberry, renowned for later creating Star Trek. Roddenberry's 24 episodes of imaginative storytelling showcased the enigmatic gunfighter Paladin, blending action, drama, and thought-provoking themes. His exceptional talent earned him the Writers Guild of America Award for Best Original Script in 1957. As the show's success soared, Roddenberry's influence ignited a passion for exploring space with Star Trek. Though the days of Paladin may seem distant, Gene Roddenberry's work endures, reminding us of storytelling's power.
Have gun will travel owes much of its allure to Roddenberry's brilliance, celebrated across generations of fans. His legacy and impact on television history are a testament to the lasting influence of talented writers. Let us cherish the memories of this classic series and celebrate the creative brilliance of Gene Roddenberry, the man who fearlessly ventured where few storytellers had gone before. And so, the saga of Have Gun Will Travel stands tall, etched in the hearts of those who fell in love with the charm of the Old West and the brilliance of its creator, Gene Roddenberry. Through the magic of his words, we were transported to a world where honor, courage, and adventure reigned supreme. In the annals of television history, one show stands out, etching itself into the nation's fabric, Have Gun Will Travel. Premiering in 1957, this classic Western series enthralled audiences with the enigmatic paladin, played brilliantly by Richard Boone. Yet, behind the glitz lay a hidden tale involving Victor da Costa, claiming to be paladin's true inspiration. He battled me to the giant CBS for three decades, fighting for creative identity. In 1991, justice was finally served, but da Costa had passed away at 83, leaving a bittersweet victory. Ironically, the court ruling blocked the show's re-release. Nonetheless, his tenacity raised crucial questions about creative ownership. Have Gun Will Travel Endures is a timeless gem, but let's also remember Victor da Costa's unyielding spirit, a real-life paladin fighting for truth. In the dimly lit, smoke-filled room, television executives brainstormed ideas for a new Western series in 1957. Richard Boone, with his rugged charm, became the lead in the chosen concept, Have Gun, Will Travel. Little did they know it would become an iconic show. Paladin, portrayed by Boone, was a sophisticated gun for hire seeking justice in the lawless Wild West, a symbol of honor and chivalry. The show's popularity skyrocketed with gripping storylines and complex characters. It explored themes of redemption and compassion, making Paladin a relatable hero. Despite success, Boone felt conflicted about the series. Yet, his portrayal ensured Paladin's legend lived on. Have Gun Will Travel gained critical acclaim and a dedicated fanbase, leaving a lasting impression on television history. It influenced other westerns and left a mark on popular culture. This seemingly absurd idea became a timeless classic, capturing the essence of the Wild West and the human spirit. As the dust settles on Paladin's adventures, we fondly remember the impact of this series on television and storytelling. It taught us that heroes come in all forms and inspired us to rise above in harsh times. Have Gun Will Travel In 1957, the iconic series Have Gun Will Travel premiered, leaving a lasting impact on television. The enigmatic protagonist, Paladin, portrayed by Richard Boone, captivated audiences. His appearance, initially in Midnight Blue, complemented his mesmerizing blue eyes. As the show progressed, his attire evolved to a modern black, mirroring his mysterious persona. Regardless of color, he was known as the Man in Black, symbolizing unseen forces guiding him through the Wild West. Paladin was not just a hired gun, but a chivalrous symbol of justice in lawless times. Richard Boone's impeccable portrayal revealed a complex man shaped by his past. Each episode delved into his struggles and inner demons, captivating viewers. Have Gun Will Travel explored themes of morality, honor, and consequences, reflecting the human condition. It showcased the beauty and brutality of the West. Today, the series continues to enthrall new generations with its powerful storytelling and unforgettable characters. Paladin's legacy endures as a true hero defined by principles, not attire. So, let's toast to the man who brought justice to the lawless land, Paladin. The man in black or blue, depending on the legend you choose to believe.